Hey everyone, I just got done watching The Last Witch Hunter, and it was an interesting movie. I was pleasantly surprised by how much I enjoyed it. It was a high-intensity fantasy, which doesn't come around very often to the big screen. And since it came out last year, I, I think that it's definitely been a while since something like this has, has, has been around. Um, I think that it was very similar to... Uh, the Chronicles of Riddick, which makes sense because Vin Diesel is also the main character in this movie. He's joined by Michael Caine and Elijah Wood and Rose Leslie, who plays Egret on Game of Thrones. So uh, the acting was fantastic. I think that they were different roles than anything that I've seen them in before, and I think that that definitely speaks to how versatile the actors and actresses are. Um, the movie itself... Uh, it was very intricate. It wasn't complicated, but there were so many things going on that I, I'm probably going to have to watch it again. Um, and I think that it worked because that is how you know these types of, of stories go. Like if, if you're into the fantasy novels, um, you know the fantasy movies, Dungeons and Dragons, and stuff like that. It it has a lot of background and history and very in depth, you know information that, that's going on uh, that you might not see the first time around. So, like I said, I, I might have to watch it again. Um, it was a little slow at the beginning. I think that they were trying to explain to you as much as possible so that you could follow the plot more effectively, and I think that that worked. And even though it was slow at the beginning, it definitely ramped up, and the ending was fantastic. It was action-adventure the entire way through. Uh, and I think that it's because Vin Diesel is very passionate about this type of stuff. It, not very well known. Um, he is like a dungeon master for Dungeons and Dragons. So he obviously enjoys this type of stuff very much. And I think that because he was so passionate about it, he nailed his role. And I think that the entire movie worked because all of the actors, you know, nailed their characters. I think that they all played them very well. Um, I mean, there's, like I said, there's so many side stories. There's twists. Um... I don't even want to get into most of the plot because I don't think I could I could do it justice, and it would probably take me about a half an hour. So I'll I'll leave you with you know very very good movie if you're if you're into the fantasy novels and the fantasy movies and this type of stuff you're gonna love it. If you're not, I would say give it a chance. Just try it out. Give it a watch. If not, it's like an hour and a half, maybe hour forty five minutes. So it's not that big of a deal. Um, yeah. So thanks very much for watching. If you have any other movies that you'd like me to review, please leave a comment below. If you have any questions or discussions that you have, um, leave something below as well. So yeah, thanks very much for watching, and I'll see everyone later.